Hello there. Welcome back to a new video. In this video, I'll be showing you how to make a basic calculator on scratch. Basic one. So first, yeah, you can keep the scratch card if you want. You can just put any character. Just one. But I don't like this scratch card I'm going to replace it from something I have in my backpack yes much better I've got the scratch 2.01 so first what you need to do is take out a when clicked block first go to the variables and delete this variable and make three variables first one first number second one second number third variable answer So first what we, we what we need to ask is what is our first number so let's type in what is your first number and after you respond to that let me show you you can type like whatever like hello I don't know but has to be a number it will show you what the, the, your answer is in this block and we can use that by putting like a first number variable and setting that to the answer we do the same for what is your second number and also here you can keep track of your numbers so we'll set our second number to the answer so let's test it out what is your first number two second number five as you can see it, it will record the numbers here so you don't forget and also it's important for the answer so what we want to do is yeah you should make a block call it ask function and answer and give answer so function means addition subtraction multiplication division so we will ask that and I will show you later why we are using a block a custom block to do that so now we want to ask do you want to add subtract Mul multiply or divide and question mark as usual and we want to take out an if then else statement and put the equal sign and put answer because it will record what we say so I want to check if the answer is either add, subtract, multiply or divide. Now this is why I made a block because if it was neither of them, it would just resume on. So what I want to do is I wanted to ask again. So I'll put this block underneath 
if it's neither any of them I'll show you how so just first type in add and when it's add what we want to do is set answer to want to take out a plus block from here and the first number plus second number makes sense because you're adding them together this will be your answer so one we want to duplicate it and this time we're going to say subtract and what we want to do is instead of them adding they're going to be subtracting by using the subtract sub block and we do the same for multiply multiply take the block with the asterisk it might not look like a multiplication symbol but it's the symbol for multiplication in coding so you have to use it so what then it will be multiply and the final one divide duplicate this type in divide here and take this fraction block like the slash slash means fraction meaning divide so that's what fraction actually is like 1 over 2 is 1 divided by 2 3 over 8 is 3 divided by 8 that's what fraction really is so then we want to put first number and second number and in this else block meaning that it will check that it was none of these we are going to put this in here the block the custom block meaning it will restart it again and what we want to do at the end is put a save block not the save for two seconds just the save block it will save forever and we will say we want to go to the operators get two join blocks and put this join block inside the second slot of the join block and what we want to type in the first slot is the answer is and you could put answer in then you put answer inside of this and then you can put exclamation mark if you don't want exclamation mark you do it like this the, the answer is zero because it hasn't calculated yet so but if you want with the exclamation mark you do it as, like how i did before so we want to put this so let's see it now in action what is your first number? 2. What is your second number? 2. Do you want to add, subtract, multiply or divide? I'm going to do add. Everybody knows 2 plus 2 is 4. So add. As you can see, it is working. Let's try for hmm, 8 multiplied by 6 makes 48. 6 is our first number, second number 8 and multiply. The answer is 48. See, and now let's try whatever. Let me just type some random numbers and let's type in trash as a function that is funny it will ask again no matter whatever you, you do it'll never accept until you give either any of these four so yeah guys 
that is how to make a calculator on scratch if you enjoy these videos and want to see more scratch tutorials or want to see an animation early like and subscribe so yeah guys see you in the next video bye